I don't eat that a lot, guys. But I think I do. But <laughs> I think I don't. Guys, welcome to my channel. It's your girl, Princess Rebel. And in today's video, as you guys can tell by the title, we're gonna be doing a mukbang or mukbang, mukbang, <laughs> whatever you like to call it. But anywho, so I'm so hungry, guys. I have some food here. This is just some rice with lentil. This is how it looks like. It looks really, really yummy. I can't wait to eat it. Mm, mm, mm. I cooked this food myself, by the way. So we have some rice with lentils. And then this is some leftover chapati from last night that I want to eat. So just have chapo. Yeah. So by the way, um i did this makeup look in case you guys want to see how i did it because i feel really really cute today make sure to check out the link in my description where i show you guys how to achieve this makeup look um yeah <sighs> yeah let's pray for the food dear lord we thank you for blessing us with this amazing meal bless it as we take it in jesus name we pray amen I love to talk while I eat. <laughs> Anywho, mm. so nice. I really love the lentils, guys. Mm. <laughs> I can't tell you how much hungry. I have been I've been feeling so hungry guys and this food is just it it's so yummy mm. 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 Mm -mm -mm. I remember this. <laughs> I loved rice so much. Even when I was growing up, I used to love rice so much. I hated ugali or rather cornmeal. I never liked cornmeal because we would cook cornmeal from Sunday to Sunday. Imagine that. Cornmeal, ugali with skuma wiki from Sunday to Sunday. It used to be like not every week. Sometimes we'll have like chapatis like sun on Sundays, and not every week, by the way. So, mm. <laughs> well, back then growing up it was really difficult like wow ugali and skuma wiki was the order of the day in the house and we'll be like please can we have like a change of menu because you just get so tired of it so tired I just, I did not get it, like, when I was a kid, I did not get it. I was like, why can't we just have a change of menu? Like, why can't we just eat something else? But, I guess my parents were not in, you know, they were basically broke, like, because we, we couldn't afford, like, to eat proper meals, like, Mm -mm. Ugali and Skumawiki every day, that's, that's not it. So, that's why I really loved so much to eat rice or chapati because mm -mm. that was so rare in our house. <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> it was so rare. This food is a lot. I don't think I'm gonna finish because I'm really feeling 
I don't eat that a lot, guys. But I think I do. But <laughs> I think I don't. A few moments later. So, I have my tea here with me. I always love to like eat my food with some black tea because, oh, it just slaps harder. <laughs> mm. Wow. Plus, I did not put sugar in my black tea. I just love it without sugar. Mm. Mm. I was so hungry. I told myself I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna eat until I finish like shooting, and that's what I did. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> mm. This food is so yummy. I think I'm gonna show you guys how I make my rice with lentils in in my vlog because. This is so good. It's so so good. Mm -hmm. I'm so glad like I know how to cook my own meals. There's a video I watched and <laughs> I was so shocked. This lady was like, she doesn't know how to cook. She even had, she even had no idea on how rice was cooked. <laughs> that was so weird to me because you know, forties. What was what were you doing? What are you doing with your teen years, with your early twenties, with your thirties? Like, what were you doing? This lady did not know how to cook. Doesn't know how to cook even rice. Like, just rice is as basic as just boiling it. She had no freaking idea <laughs> on how to cook rice. That was crazy to me, guys. That was really crazy. I'm so glad like I know how to cook my own meals. Even if it's something that I don't know how to cook, I would just Google it, I will look a recipe up and I'll figure it I'll figure it out and I will cook it. Some adults out here don't know how to cook. And it's so hard to believe. I know. But for me I'm so glad like even when I was growing up when we our kids i used to stay with my grandma and she would always teach us how to cook we would always be in the kitchen my sister and i will always be in the kitchen we will assist her when she's cooking so that's how i basically started like you know getting like some cooking lessons from my grandma when I used to stay with her at that time i was even not yet in primary school i hadn't even started going to school but i was in like nursery school yeah so i'm so thankful to my grandma and to my mom because and to my aunties as well because i grew up with them because they really instilled some cooking lessons in me which have never left me of course as i grew up I learned like different cooking techniques. I learned my own recipes. Well, I'm super duper grateful to my grandma and to my mom, my aunties, any female figure that I grew up with that taught me how to cook. I'm so grateful because I cannot believe that there are people out here who are even in their forties and they don't know how to cook. Like what? That is so crazy to me. 
that's so crazy but personally just to cook like you know when you grow up in the village <laughs> if you grew up in the village now you know but it's not like in every other village but as we used to use firewood to cook every meal like it's not like charcoal firewood so you would go out to fetch firewood come back lit the fire and start cooking let me tell you the process of just lighting the fire is just so tedious by the time you're done lighting the fire you're so tired and <laughs> you still have to cook <laughs> it was so crazy it was so crazy it was so much hard work and at that time we were we were kids i was even i was barely seven years old and i used to do a lot <laughs> I had known so much this memory never leaves me i always remember how we will do chores in the village i don't know why I, that memory has never left me i think it has really it really traumatized me in a way because i used to feel like this is so much hard work which was it was it really was but i'm so glad it happened because I will never be this person that I am today if I didn't go through that I'm starting to feel like I'm full wow I need to stop eating mm. Mm -mm. I'm so happy this is my first mukbang video is it my first no I think it's my second mukbang video mukbang 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 <laughs> yeah it's my second one i really enjoy eating so i was like the first one we did with my boyfriend when we went out and you know going out you know restaurant food is not usually healthy so i was just like mm, i really want to do a mukbang video but i don't want to eat unhealthy food so what do i do then i just said like oh, okay it's mukbang is just eating so i can basically use my food here at home a really nice home cooked meal and do a mukbang video just sit down eat and talk to you guys like i'm doing right now i really enjoy it <laughs> this might be my you know my favorite type of videos to me because mm, <laughs> sitting here and talking to you guys you know i feel like i'm talking to my best friend like how we just sit down and talk about anything and everything that's how i feel mm. this is how much i've eaten guys like this space over here that's the much i've eaten and i'm feeling so full if i continue i think i'm gonna burst mm. I don't know. I think the the lentils are super filling. Ooh. Mm. Wow. Guys, <laughs> when I was setting up this camera, I took so much time. Like, I was just... I it took so much time setting up the camera because i'm just looking at the pr proper place to place it and all that stuff and then my food got cold <laughs> but it's not like super cold cold it's like warm but it took some time to like set up the camera because mm. i'm so full i might want i might just have to leave this food Oh, I'm even feeling sweaty because I've eaten so fast. I think I must have to finish because if I leave this food on this plate, who's gonna eat it? I don't want to waste food, I don't want to throw it away with this economy. I don't want to throw away food also um 
there's something that really amazes me like this korean guy or women who eat food like they eat really fast i know some videos are like fast forwarded but some of them are just in real time and they eat super fast like when somebody can just eat like 30 eggs in one sitting and it's boiled eggs you know <clears throat> how heavy boiled eggs are you know if it was something like scrambled eggs i could eat even like you know four or five and that i'll be like oh i've had enough of eggs but someone is eating boiled eggs and they're eating like six eggs and they're like how the hell does one eat six freaking eggs <coughs> in one sitting and that's just the least amount of eggs i'm talking about that's just the least amount <coughs> i wonder what are their stomachs made of because i don't get it and it's not just eggs there's even like pork there there's some like salad there you also have a drink there pasta oh my god it's usually a lot of food and someone will eat that food and they'll finish it i think like i think their stomachs are just used to it like their stomachs have really expanded a lot because of you know they're used to eating a lot of food they've been doing this for a long time so it's just normal for their expo <laughs> stomachs to expand and be able to accommodate that amount of food because look at me i'm unable to finish this i feel like i want to bust i feel like i want to bust oh i feel like i want to bust oh my god so i honestly cannot comprehend how those people like eat that amount of food i don't get it mm -mm. do they have st do they have like four stomachs or something do they have four stomachs? Mm. Maybe they have four. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Oh my god. I've eaten really fast. Wow. We have like one spoon, one spoonful left. Oh. Mm. See how I'm setting, guys. Mm -mm. Mm. Wow. And I'm done. Nothing is left. I'm just left with the tea. I am full to the brim. I don't think I'll even eat supper. Ah, but I think I do. <laughs> I think I'll eat supper. <laughs> mm. Ooh, guys. Mm. That was some really good homemade meal. I really enjoyed it. Mm. Yeah, guys. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Cheese.